I'm about three minutes from the Mumbles man's house. We're going to the cave today to visit Edmond Dante. And if he's not home, we're going to slip back a few few blocks and go to the big beach. We'll see how it goes. The cave. We're headed in. Eddie's joining us. And the Mumbles man. And it's a slight shower coming, but no lightning. We got a lot more wind than we had at home. You can see it's kind of breezy at the cave today, but the cave is cave is getting better. Let's we'll see if Dorian Dorian helped us any since we've been here, and I don't know how long. The old cave is breaking up. Look at her. Damn, it's rough. Got a scratchy 14. Let's see what it is. Probably a bottle cap. I got my little scoop today, a little holes in it. I don't see nothing. Looks like 14. Couldn't fall through, it ain't that little. Whatever it is, it must be little. I ain't gonna fight it. I can't see it though. The hell with it. Stand by. Solid one and two. Maybe a piece of stainless steel or something. Then we got it. I don't see no ones or twos. Just like the first target. I don't see a damn thing. Oh, I see it. Look at that. There's old Ed Mine. Are you home? Are you home, buddy? I don't think you're home. But we'll venture that way. Well, there's a cave down there. I've been that far. Not one target. Since that first one, I mean. I got a feeling we ain't gonna be here very long. I ain't seen, I seen, uh oh, wait a minute. Damn, 15. Fifteen on the first scoop. Oh, it's a fine one too. Fine, 15. Hey. Then they can't hear me. Well, the Bumbles man's got a bottle cap. Eddie's got a bottle cap. It's kind of bleak. Well, we moved up a little higher. It's been a bonanza. 
coins and keys and Eddie's got some kind of ring. It's unbelievable. Everything. Talk is everywhere. Let's take a look at Eddie's ring he found. It looked good in the sand. In the sand. It, looked, it looked really good. But it's bling. See the backside? Oh, yeah, bling. But it looks good and right. <laughs> it looked good. You first dig it up, that gave you three, said, ring, three nitro right there. I said, man, I got me a gold ring. <laughs> it's gold colored. You ain't kidding. <laughs> Well, I'm home, got everything washed off. You ain't gonna believe what we dug today. I'm not a corn hunter, you know, but when we walked up on that one area, we had nothing else to do but dig. We left them biting right there. Now that place has been torn down over a year. And I heard stories about people going in there and finding coins and coins and coins, but I said, there ain't gonna be much left, Danny. We we'll woke up here and check it out. Oh my God. And on my way home, I got this. This is a, I think it's a Vietnam era MK1 Navy knife. Guy called me up, said, I, got a, I need a knife to, I need to restore it. I don't know if this took or not. I'll have to take a chance. She should be okay. Well, <clears throat> here's the nut. I didn't count the pennies. Got 30 quarters, 17 dimes, three nickels, and I didn't know I had a Susan B. Anthony. I got a 54 nickel and didn't check any of the pennies. To hell with them. My arm is tired. See you tomorrow. Oh, let me show you that knife. Hold on a minute. Turned out okay. Some of them really deep spots in the blade didn't come out. I gotta put some oil on the handle. I put some on it, but I gotta put some more oil in the back. Turn out nice. Nice old taquito.